The finger tracking is really cool to use. I can't wait to see where this technology will be in a couple of years time. It's super glitchy and definitely isn't there yet. When you put your hands close together, it loses track completely and it doesn't feel quite right at times. When I'm rotating my hands, you can see clearly it's copying me exactly and it's timed perfectly. It feels straight out of sci-fi when you're actually using it. When I pinch my fingers and make signs, it still works amazing. When you open and close your hand, the same goes. It's just incredible to see in real time. It feels so much better once you pick up a controller. A big part of that is just having something to hold as well as having the tactile feedback. In Half-Life Alex, it groups your last three fingers together and then your pointer finger and then your thumb. It's not as cool, but it definitely still works really great. Bone works is the exact same as Half-Life Alex, as you can see here. Physics Playground also works the same. This game reminds me a lot of Boneware and it's a really good native alternative for the Quest 2. Full finger tracking, like on Valve's Knuckles, is definitely on my wish list for the Quest 3.